Hey guys, what is up? I am back at Sideways Performance. Uh, went ahead and picked up a temporary uh, diff cover for the differential, which is what broke on the car. Uh, so this is a little quick unboxing video. So this is a, OE, a used OEM part for now, just to get the car back up and running until I decide which diff I'm gonna end up upgrading with. Yeah, should be. Yep. So literally the other one just snapped yeah, it in looks the middle. Like from what they were saying right here. Oh, it gave because it, right it has here. this notch, it's it snapped. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. So yeah. definitely just a replacement to get the car back up and running while I decide what kind of diff I want to run. So cool. Alright guys, so I'm currently underneath the car, you can see a little bit of damage in the exhaust where it hit, and then you can see the mounts where they're broken right there, and on this side right here, let's get to focus, right there, and then the drive shaft is no longer there, so the reason why this broke the mount on the on the, the cover that I bought possibly gave out or gave out because it was weakened by these cuts right here on the actual uh, cover and then that's what made the diff drop and then made the diff break so the differential was definitely sorry the the drive shaft was definitely not the weak point here it was the mount that decided to just give out which we're gonna go ahead and replace for now uh, with the same exact part until I decide like I said on what to do stay tuned Hey guys, so I was able to get the diff out yeah. out of the car, sitting right there. Okay. Here's the uh, where the drive shaft hit the exhaust. It seems like it's just surfaced, dented in, no holes. What we do here. All right, guys. So I got the the diff housing off of the differential. I have it set off to the side right here. I'm about to clean it off. Clean off the oil residue and the uh, gasket. RTV gasket that's on there that way I could go ahead and put some more RTV and seal it back up and get it ready to toss back in the car um, and have a measurement for the drive shaft so the car should be running pretty soon uh, so stay tuned.
Alright guys, so this is a metal bracket that was welded onto the car to hold the diff in place. Um, until I decide on what to go with. I have been looking at several different types of options, but I haven't yet decided on what to go with. Uh, for now, it has held up. I've done a couple of pulls and it's stayed in place. So hopefully it lasts for uh, quite a bit. That way I decide uh, what to go with. Anyways guys, that's going to be it for this video. Stay tuned and hit that like, like button and subscribe.